Hello, welcome to Music Time. So we're gonna to start today by reviewing our Book in the Book of Mormon song. So for this one, anyone that memorizes it, you can also film it at home. If you have it, have you have it memorized, you could sing it with a parent or by yourself or with a sibling. And then if you send us the video, we will still post your picture and give you your cards. So you can work on that from home. So we'll practice it once with the actions. When you do it at home, you don't have to do the actions, but you can if you want. So we'll start today with the books in the Book of Mormon. First and second books of Nephi, Jacob, Enos, Jeremiah, Horns of Mormon and Mosiah in the Book of Mormon. Alma, Hill, and third for Nephi, for many there and for Yonah, learn the teachings of the prophets in the Book of Mormon. All right, excellent. So. Um, you can go ahead and practice that at home and send us your video if you are able to do all of the books in the Book of Mormon. All right, for the next song, we're gonna learn scripture power. So I feel like most of you already know the chorus to this. So if everyone can run and grab their Books of Mormon, we are going to need these for this song. So I'll give you a minute to run and grab a Book of Mormon. All right, so we're gonna start with the first verse. So if you look over here at my board, the first verse is split into two sections. So the first part starts with because. So we're gonna learn the first verse. It says, because I want to be like the Savior. And I can. So we're gonna just practice singing that a couple of times. Because I want to be like the Savior, and I can. Okay, one more time. Want to be like the Savior, and I can. All right, back over here. So, what can we do in order to become like the Savior? So, this song talks about two things that we can go and do. So, the first is to read the scriptures, and um, the second is to follow His plan. So the words say, um, I'm reading his instructions. So we find his instructions in the Book of Mormon. And I'm reading his instructions and I'm following his plan. So his plan is the plan of salvation, which is down here. So we're gonna put that right here. So we're gonna start with, because I want to be, like the Savior and I can. I'm reading his instructions. I'm following his plan. So we're going to read that part. We're going to sing that part now two times. Because I want to be like the Savior and I can. I'm reading his instructions. I'm following his plan. Because I want to be like the Savior and I can. I'm reading his instructions. I'm following his plan. Because I want the okay, we're going to do one more. Because I want to be like the 
Savior and I can. I'm reading his instructions. I'm following his plan. Okay, perfect. So let's go back over to our board. So that's the first because. Because I want to be like the Savior and I can. So the second because is because I want the power. So this one says, because I want the power, his word will give to me. So when I think about the power that the scriptures give to me, um, I feel like when I read the scriptures every day, I am more patient with my family. So that means that when someone does something that annoys me or makes me kind of sad or angry, I'm able to not get angry right away. I'm able to instead think about it and think about different approaches and how I can talk to them about it instead of being angry. Um, also, I feel like when I read the scriptures, I'm more motivated to choose the right and to do good things. So I think that that is a very special power that reading the scriptures gives to me. So can you all think right now in your minds, what is a special power that you think you get when you read the scriptures? All right, good job. So we're gonna sing up to that part in the song two times. Because I want to be like the Savior and I can. I'm reading his instructions. I'm following his plan. Because I want the power his word will give to me. Okay. All right. So what can we do in order to get this power? So, the song's next words say, I'm changing how I live, I'm changing what I'll be. So I really like in this picture, we see at the start, um, this little girl is helping her mom, so that's some ways we can maybe change how we live is we can help the people around us. And I'm changing what I'll be. I like this little superhero here at the bottom, he has the scriptures in his hand, and he has the CTR on the front of his shirt. So we'll put that right here. And we will sing up to that point. And everyone get their scriptures ready because we're going to sing, we're going to sing the whole verse and then we're going to do the chorus too. Because I want to be like the Savior and I can. I'm reading his instructions. I'm following his plan. Because I want the power his word will give to me. I'm changing how I live. I'm changing what I'll be. Scripture power keeps me safe from sin. Scripture power is the power to win. Scripture power, every day I need. The power that I get each time I read. So this next part, if you look here on the screen, it says, I'll find the sword of truth in each scripture that I learn. So today, I have the sword of truth. So this is gonna represent the sword of truth for us. All right, so we're gonna sing this part. Find the sword of truth in each scripture that I learn. All right, next. It says, I'll take the shield of faith from these pages that I turn. So 
the sword of truth. We're going to find the sword of truth and we're going to take the shield of faith. All right, let's practice those two lines. Find the sword of truth in each scripture that I learn. I'll take the shield of faith from these pages that I turn. Okay. I'll find the sword of truth from each scriptures that I learn. I'll take the shield of faith from these pages that I turn. Okay, so next it says, I'll wear each vital part of the armor of the Lord. So here we have the breastplate and the helmet that does not like to stay on. We're just gonna, we're just gonna imagine the helmet is on. All right, so let's practice up to this point, okay? Find the sword of truth in the scriptures that I learn. I'll take the shield of faith from each page that I turn. I'll wear each vital part of the armor of the Lord. truth in the scriptures that I learn. I'll take the shield of faith from these pages that I turn. I'll wear each vital part of the armor of the Lord and fight my daily battles and win a great reward. Okay, so and fight my daily battles. And then, this is my great reward. And win a great reward. Okay, can anyone think about how the scriptures help us fight our battles? So think about that. Does anyone have any ideas? I think this talks, this goes to um, how we talked about power earlier. How it can help us to be more patient and to be more loving with our family. And so that is a way that it can help us fight our battles. It also can help us have the Holy Ghost with us and he can give us promptings of good choices to make. All right, so now we're gonna do the whole second verse from the start. And this includes the chorus, so get ready with your scriptures. Oh, of truth in the scriptures that I learned I'll take the shield of faith from these pages that I turn. I'll wear each vital part of the armor of the Lord and fight my daily battles and win a great reward. Scripture power keeps me safe from sin. Scripture power is the power to win. Scripture power, every day I need the power that I get each time I read. All right, great job. So next, next we're just going to review really quick the song, Life in the Scriptures, that we practiced last week. So if you just want to um, review this song, that would be really great. Yeah. 
I would like to bear my testimony that I know that as we read the scriptures that we'll see power in our lives and we'll be able to um, feel that Heavenly Father loves us and I'm so excited to be able to read the scriptures and to share these songs with you. I'm going to say Saints name Jesus Christ. Amen.